I hope all are well. This is our first tutorial about PHP and to welcome to our learning zone. PHP is a server based programming language. It's most popular language for web development. Most popular and largest website are using PHP like Facebook. So learning to PHP you need some basic knowledge about HTML, CSS, not advanced and then need a server real or fake cause php is a server based programming language but we will use fake server or local host for our project or tutorial there are some popular local host or jam or wam is most popular in my tutorial i will use jam so let's go first how to download and install jam and then how to create your first folder for writing php code i mean how to start your first php coding so first open your browser and write jam go to the first link apachefriends.org this is the official link of jam download for your operating system windows linux mac operating system it's very simple just click for windows and it's, it will be start download when complete download install installation process is same all software it's very simple next 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 but if you face any problem please knock me at facebook i will try to solve it now when you complete your software and then you, you need to the install your software when complete your install you will get jam jam control panel okay like this control panel you will get from this control panel you need to start two options apache start mysql start now go to your browser and write localhost you will get you can see the php my admin php info how to guides fox this is the dashboard of jamf control panel okay but how to write your first php code where you installed your software i have already installed my software into my c drive go to c drive go to the jam folder then go to ht docs now create a folder for write your php code i write i create a folder like my past php project something like that as you wish open now take a Text dot document txt file and write name index dot php. This extension will be index dot php. Yes. Now edit with notepad plus plus. I hope you already know it, cause you already write the here HTML CSS code. Edit with notepad plus plus. Now write your first php code. Uh, here I will show a simple structure. I hope you already know. This is the HTML5 declaration code. HTML. if you run our uh, project we can see that here is no first you need open your browser write localhost localhost slash your folder that you created in your htdocs your folder name my first php project 
slash your first principal project. Here you need to see check if you create a index file. If your file name is index, it will be auto loaded. Okay, localhost slash your folder name just. But if your file name is another like Sandeep, uh, not index, another, it will need to write your file name folder slash slash something like that uh, that's your for file name but if your file name is already index.php uh, don't need to write it just press enter you can see nothing anything here because our file is blank now write our php code first time add Title, title. I hope you already know it. My first PHP code, something like that. You can write your wish body, body close. Now, here I want to write um, my first PHP like that. I hope you already know what I am doing. H three slash or ESP my PSP running zone just deep content sec section just uh, I'm creating this just showing to you organizing nothing else you can write PHP here the footer text p tab w code again lali w code again here we will write our php code mm. we can check our site by refresh you can see my php learning zone our h3 tag and uh, this is our footer we can organizely write it uh, here we can write our php code php syntax we start with less than greater than then double question mark or question sign now we start php okay this is the php block it's called according to the php language php block we start with less than greater than then question mark okay less than question mark php it will end at question mark greater than okay this is the php block your php all code will be here you can html write html language write into the php file dot php but you need to when you want to write the php code you need to mask the file extension dot php okay right echo i intend to learning php uh, 
hello world something like that i intend to learn in php just refresh you can see hello world i intend to learn in php just is to just something organize uh, use your friend style here i am showing very fast just simple i will start uh, next time uh, for the continuously i will uh, create tutorial about php from php functions php building functions and uh, uh, tricks and tricks then finally i will show the project live project how to develop a project in my live project okay but uh, showing in live project you need to first uh, php basics learning okay here i run just simple i hope you already know if you know please skip mm, add a section In, in, uh, it's not important I am creating just showing it organizedly You already know how to catch the class file or class dot case your dot then your class name dot then your class name okay template mm, with artshop pixel margin zero total you will it will just one minute please check for oh, sorry you have mistake or spelling to be id t is with at short pig 800 pixel margin 0 to okay you can see folder is organizedly now also we can check um, error background uh, DDD font color um, black we can check it and now also we can use mean height right okay this is our PHP code this is our header this is our footer and this is our php code you can write anything in your php code okay hello world i am php learner you can check here hello world i am php learner you need to php block then code echo echo mean print it will be printed in your browser i mean output okay then need double quotation and it ended signal semicolon okay then you need to write anything hello world then also you can write in here okay you can also write here like something that just first write a php block php php less than ocean sign ocean sign greater than then php echo double quotation semicolon just write your text you can see the same result okay my php learning bin also you can write in the footer section just copy 
या राइट ए पी एच पी ब्लॉग पी एच पी दिस इज द पी एच पी ब्लॉग राइट इ को डबल कोटेशन सेमी कोलोन राइट द कोड यू नीड टू नो इफ यू यूजिंग द डबल कोटेशन इन आउटसाइड एंड इन साइड यू नीड टू सिंगल कोटेशन ओके अदरवाइज इट विल नॉट वर्क you will see the same changes okay quotation learn with w code arjun but if you want to uh, view here the double quote you can see the w code w code arjun is block single quote you want to the double quote so you can use uh, outside single quote single quote and here you can use the double quote it will same result and your expectation will be fulfilled you can see the double quote okay so i hope you will enjoy with me and i will start my tutorial i will firstly create some basics about php it will must learn also you can check the php php.net php.net this is the Uh, official site of PHP. You can uh, check here the a uh, lots of uh, functions, building functions. PHP have uh, building one uh, thousands plus one uh, thousands more than one thousands uh, building functions. I think uh, you need to don't need to learn, but just check that which functions it. Uh, what kinds of works and how to use it i hope you will uh, read this slide and thanks for the next tutorial please subscribe my channel thanks